So today what I want to show you is some details of the right and wrong way to do a composite decking. Now while there are many different brands of composite, the fastening method is usually pretty the same and some of the trim out methods are, are very, very similar. There are some variances in material and this particular material is a Fiberon and what we see here is that the edges are unpainted. So when you get in here, you're going to see that when you cut it, it's not painted. So when you're doing the decking boards and you have these unpainted edges on an angle like this, you need to put a piece of composite on the front. You'll notice that we didn't do that with the cedar. We have cedar matching, but we can't put cedar here because that will wear too quickly whenever your edge of your foot is on there. So in this particular application, we had to do the cedar to match the cedar handrails. But right here, we needed to do a composite because it's much, much harder and it will not wear on the edge. So that's, that's one of the things. Now, some composites, when you cut them, they have a very similar color, but this particular one, it's a little more reasonably priced, has a non-painted edge when you cut it, or it doesn't have the color all the way through, I should say. And that means you have to put something like this on the front. So be careful of what you're expecting. Other types of boards, of uh, composite boards, also have scalloped to keep them from twisting and bowing. So you need to know how you're going to trim them out before you do it. And so that's one of the details of composite decking that you should be aware of.